Today I would like to talk about anti-aging or longevity pills. It is about metformin and niacin or nicotinamide. So we probably know this uh, person, this is David Sinclair, a very famous uh, scientist who works in area of uh, aging and uh, rejuvenation and, age and slow slowing down of aging. He himself 50 years old, but as you can see from this photo, he hardly look uh, older than uh, in his uh, late 30s. So, and he is using this program of rejuvenation on himself and on his father and very uh, much happy about the result. What his achievement? What are this, his achievements? So, in 2002, he discovered the key role of NAD plus uh, substance in aging. NAD plus, we will talk later about this. Then he discovered also some uh, important ferments and uh, enzymes which are important in the gen expression of DNA of the genes and uh, in the repair of the DNA. Then in March 2017, he reported the synthesis or discover of substance which is, has abbreviation NMN and <coughs> NADH precursor. So he <coughs> organized clinical trials uh, for, in, uh, for six months to see uh, the impact of these substances on uh, aging. What was discovered? That, uh, okay, first uh, again about uh, nicotine, um, uh, adenine, ad, nicotinamide adenine adenocleotide, NAD+, which were indicated before he uh, discovered uh, its important role of this substance. So this substance is important to produce uh, a, a molecules of adenosine triphosphate. And then there's the triphosphate molecules are uh, work like batteries. They release energy uh, inside the cell uh, when it is necessary and, and get to uh, adenosine diphosphate substance. Okay, and then they can be in mitochondria, they can be recharged and the adenosine diphosphate will, will turn to adenosine tri triphosphate. But for this, uh, NAD for us uh, substance is, uh, is necessary, it, it is very important. If there is shortage of NAD for us, then the production or energy slows down. Well, and then uh, NAD for us substance has a uh, vital role in DNA repair, and uh, it is also scavenging, uh, uh, re re reducing concentration of, of the free radicals inside the cell. Uh, it was, he, he just demonstrated in his research that NAD concentration increase during fasting, exercise, and caloric restriction. NAD uh, plus levels decline during aging, and it's, it can be a major contribution to the aging process. Indeed, if we have less concentration of NAD plus, then production uh, and recharging of these batteries of ATP going slowly, and uh, then all the uh, we are losing energy. We, we cannot uh, do uh, be uh, as active as we are when we are young. Well, and then <clears throat> uh, so the idea was that uh, he pro proposed the substance uh, nicotinamide uh, riboside, which uh, can be used to produce NAD plus. In, okay, let's consider uh, the, the chemical composition of the NAD+. NAD+, it is uh, the, the iron, it is uh, solved in, uh, it is dissolvable in water, the substance is dissolved in water, and then it is iron, it is, has uh, this positive uh, uh, hydrogen, it has a nicotinamide group here, nicotinamide, and then adenine group here, one, uh, uh, one, nucleoside and another nucleoside and two uh, phosphoric group okay so and it can it can be it can turn to NADH substance with uh, if two hydrogen atoms are uh, getting here so then it is not the iron it is uh, some substance which is dissolved so and then it is uh, because of this uh, the uh, chemical reactions between NA, the transfer of NAD plus to NADH, then these uh, free radicals are, uh, the concentration of free radicals can be reduced inside the cell. 
Okay, and then again, the clinical studies were organized, and uh, there was a report about the results. So the group of uh, patients uh, were uh, patients were taken one gram of uh, nicotine uh, amide riboside supplement, supplements, and for six months, not six six, six months. And uh, no uh, side effects were noted, so it's a substance relatively uh, uh, safe. But as, as we are talking before, increased level of NAD plus and uh, NAD amide and uh, RTP and IDP in, in, in living cells were measured, which is a good indication of, that, of some kind of rejuvenation. So it is good indication that uh, the cells are producing more energy and more energy more stored inside the cells. So the, the cells uh, can uh, use this uh, stored energy for uh, boosting uh, of his, his uh, actions, its actions. Well, uh, the chemical composition of the nicotine amide riboside is such that we have nicotine amide here, we have phosphoric group here, and we have this nucleotide here, okay? So it's, uh, but again, uh, if you look at this, you see this phosphoric group, and uh, it's, it's quite well known that uh, such substances can, cannot go through cell membrane because of this phosphoric group. So first, this substance has to be uh, somehow uh, in the liver uh, of human body can be can uh, be reduced to niacin uh, amide. So only this group actually synthesized. And uh, then uh, the nicotine amide gets to inside the cell and then it, get, it, it gets uh, to, it converted to, pardon me, uh, to this NAD plus, okay? So uh, as soon as he published these results, uh, very promising results. Uh, many companies around the, the, the globe started to produce these supplements and selling it and making good money uh, uh, with references to David Sinclair, but with no money to him for, for this. So he tried to uh, stop it, but uh, unsuccessfully, because nowadays people do not respect patents and uh, then uh, or uh, the uh, uh, rights, uh, patent rights, and then he is just failed to get any money from them. But they are available and uh, quite expensive. And to get uh, one gram of the, uh, the nicotinamide riboside, you have to pay eight American dollars per day. Okay, we were discussing that uh, NAD plus are very important for, for energy production. And you should not uh, uh, mix it with niacin. Niacin or nicotinic acid, it is not the same as nicotinamide. We will uh, see it further. Okay, well, the well, chemical composition is quite different. Here, the ni ni nicotinic acid, you have this OH group. Okay, so it can, uh, it is actually acid. And then we have uh, the salt of ammonium salt of, of the nicotinic acid, which is nicotinamide. And here, the nicotine. Nicotine, uh, it uh, looks similar, but you actually cannot produce uh, nicotinic acid from nicotine in your cells. And if you are smoking, it gives no advantage for your health. The vitamin 3 or this nicotinamide is produced uh, in China and uh, India uh, very cheaply. So, and available uh, in, as a retail, uh, for example, this 100 gram pack of uh, niacinamide, this is not niacin, niacinamide actually, and uh, it is available for only uh, two American dollars. Uh, 65 baht, it is about less than two American dollars plus the de delivery. And some companies already in Thailand uh, 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 are making pills from the nicotine and, and sell it uh, four times more expensive. So here, pills, a uh, half gram of nicotine amide and the price is, uh, you see, it at, at twice here, but only five, uh, only 100 gram, actually, it's only, or 50 gram, actually, 50 gram. To get 100 gram, you need, uh, you paid to 200, uh, more than 220. Uh, uh, but uh, this is uh, 
twice the price, uh, double, double price. No, no, it is uh, 200, it is four times more expensive. So you pay four times more for uh, luxury to get in, in pills, not in powder. Well, again, uh, that we show that nicotinamide is very important to produce NAD plus. So let's, and um, uh, then uh, this NAD amide is a well-known uh, vitamin B3. It is even not uh, considered as vitamin, but as food additive. And um, uh, uh, nicotinamide, uh, maximum dose uh, per day is three gram. Uh, but uh, in, in, in uh, uh, it also used uh, up to uh, eight, uh, six gram uh, per day to uh, cure schizophrenia. And uh, there were cases when some uh, people were taking nine gram per day for, for long. And uh, then uh, liver damage was uh, observed. And, uh, but uh, liver uh, had uh, completely normalized after three weeks once this uh, nicotinamide uh, was stopped. Uh, uh, stopped. Well, uh, another substance which um, uh, David Sinclair also uh, using himself, it is metformin. Metformin is a very well-known uh, uh, remedy for diabetic, diabetics, to, to cure diabetics, uh, type 2. And uh, it is recommended daily dosage is one two gram per day, and uh, some uh, side effects that it can be uh, def deficit deficiency of uh, vitamin B12 in lactic acidosis. Wh wh why lactic acidosis can be? Lactic acidosis it is the accumulation of lactic uh, acid inside the cells, and why it is happening because metformin suppressing oxidation of uh, glucose in, in mitochondria. As yes, it is suppressing oxidation, then only this, uh, uh, only uh, ATP can be produced without oxygen, uh, but this, the subproduct of this reaction is lactic acid. So in lactic acid, it is uh, uh, accumulates inside, inside the cells with uh, feeling of being tired and uh, some even burning uh, of muscles. So, and uh, sometimes even uh, high doses of the CGS, even liver can, can suffer from metformin. So uh, nobody can use this metformin without uh, medical control, without con uh, carefully, uh, careful control of, of some physician. So, okay, then, uh, uh, chemical composition of uh, metformin is quite simple. It is here. Uh, and it is available without prescription in developing countries like Thailand. It is here. It is, uh, you know, it is cheap, relatively cheap. And uh, it can be uh, relatively easy uh, prescribed in Western countries. So, <clears throat> Okay, as I said, metformin is inexpensive and safe, relatively safe. Uh, it is uh, suppressing uh, oxidation of, uh, of uh, glucose, but also it is reducing uh, risk of cancer, for example. Why? Because uh, cell, uh, cancer cells are very sensitive to, to uh, concentration of glucose in, in, in oxidation also of glucose because it's the main mechanism to produce energy inside the uh, cancer cell. And if this mechanism is suppressed, then they, they suffer the most, uh, the, the, the healthy uh, cells. Okay, then uh, it also can extend the longevity. It was also uh, uh, observed in that uh, the people who take metformin, they live longer. Okay, there, there was such guy, there is such, such one guy with a name Edward Omron. He's from California, he works as a physician. And he decided uh, to, uh, to make an experiment on himself. So it is not any recommendations, he, he cannot give any recommendations uh, like this. But just uh, describing what he, he, he was doing. 
and he was taking metformin and uh, nicotinamide. So after 23 months of taking uh, the, the vitamins without any physical exercises, without any uh, diet, special diet or fasting or something, he uh, visually improved his appearance. Uh, his uh, skin is refreshed, but and he claims that he sees some signs of rejuvenation in two years. So maybe, maybe, at least he looks relatively better. Okay, so as I said, David Sinclair is a very popular scientist, and he tries to get uh, any uh, funds, any 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 money for his laboratory. He has a laboratory in Harvard Medical School, and uh, about more than thirty persons work for him. So he is trying uh, this rejuvenation. Uh, on himself and, and his body, he is uh, taking uh, nicotinamide uh, riboside, the substance he 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 synthesized, uh, which is expensive as, as I said, and he also recommends fasting, and uh, he, he intermediate fasting. Intermediate fasting uh, in his uh, way, he uh, takes no breakfast, and he take uh, late uh, uh, late lunch about two o'clock afternoon. And a very very late dinner sometimes at night, and uh, okay, and then his uh, fasting uh, lasts about 16 hours, and once a month uh, he takes longer fasting, and he also uh, tries to uh, uh, during the weekend to have some exercises. Okay, as I said, he looks relatively young, and he claims that his father, in age of like uh, older than 50. Uh, very active and uh, very active and healthy and taking the same substances. Metformin all, he also will take, but he discovered that metformin can interfere with physical activity and it is not advisable to use metformin in days when you uh, uh, take the fit, go to fitness hall because metformin slows down, as I, I told already, metformin slows down the oxidation of uh, glucose oxidation, so only anabolic, uh, ana, uh, ana, uh, anaerobic, 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 anaerobic uh, uh, process of generation of adenosine triphosphate goes with accumulation of lactic acid. So if you take metformin, then you will get very quickly tired uh, during the exercises. So it is not recommended to take them together. Also, uh, niacinamide or nicotinamide uh, vitamin B3 is uh, work uh, such that it is suppressing uh, the uh, production of, um, uh, of lipids or fats from uh, gl gl uh, glucose. And also he uh, also decelerates the use of lipids or fatty acids as source of energy. So it is again not recommended to take them both because as one is uh, suppressing uh, generation of energy from uh, glucose, another from fats and uh, fatty acids, then it cannot be taken together. Uh, niacinamide is recommended to use uh, before uh, go to sleep because it improves uh, uh, deep sleeping, uh, while uh, metformin is probably better for uh, to take it morning if you are not supposed to have any physical activity because it's again it is. Uh, what what what, uh, metformin, what metformin is doing? Uh, it is uh, reducing the number of adenosine triphosphate molecules. So it is reducing of uh, molecules uh, stored as energy supply in the cells, and uh, the cell reacts uh, in such way that it is, it is increasing the number of mitochondria. Mitochondria is the, the center. Uh, where this uh, adenosine triphosphate molecules can be recharged from adenosine diphosphate molecules. So, as uh, more mitochondria are produced and we have more uh, NIAD plus in inside the cell, we have uh, high energy, more energy. We have actually this uh, uh, because aging. What is aging? Aging it is this your not anymore uh, so so uh, energetic like young people and then with this more mitochondria more energy produced inside the cell you feel rejuvenated this is a, the sense of, of the of the all the procedure okay then <clears throat> this is in short 
his proposals and I just uh, I also not uh, he is not recommending this it's just he describing what he is doing it is not a recommendation even he if he work in uh, medical care uh, medical research he is not giving recommendation he describing what he is doing and he is doing this uh, fasting intermediate fasting he is doing uh, he is taking nicotinamide riboside is the substance he synthesized and he is taking also uh, this uh, pills of uh, metformin. Okay, and the, as I am not a physician, I am a physicist, I am a doctor in physics, yeah? So I, I, do, I not, cannot give any recommendations, but just announce that I tra started some experiment and I also thinking about uh, what to do uh, and uh, with these substances like metformin and nicotinamide. I started at least uh, taking met, uh, nicotinamide about up to three gram uh, uh, at evening before I go to sleep. And uh, also I uh, practice uh, intermediate fasting and uh, eat only once a day uh, from five to six o'clock normally afternoon. And uh, I eat, consume a lot of meat and uh, fatty meat and, and, and oil, uh, coconut oil and maybe some vegetables. And uh, this is uh, uh, my way to reduce uh, amount of uh, glucose in blood and to reduce uh, in, uh, insulin uh, concentration. And this is all works for uh, to increase uh, energy levels and to increase this NAD plus production. And it is, uh, I hope it is uh, helping to produce uh, more mitochondria also and uh, and i feel indeed some quite quite good and uh, i feel well in my 62 years old i'm quite well i go bicycle almost every day uh one hour uh, or it is 20 kilometers one way and 20 kilometers back uh for, from the from my uh, job site okay then uh fasting is actually uh is the way is well known as in history so and it is also also has religious traditions both in in almost in every uh, every religion. So Muslims uh, have Ramadan uh, fasting, uh, uh, Christians have also fasting this before the Easter, and uh, uh, then fasting today it is uh, very popular and special intermediate fasting and. Uh, uh, to, uh, it's a very convenient way and uh, you save a lot of time if you skip the breakfast and uh, you don't eat uh, dinner and uh, or no I mean <laughs> you don't you don't have lunch but I have only dinner as I said so it is uh, actually easy way to produce and again that we were talking about this uh, nicotinamide uh, riboside with one nicotine and one uh, so it is actually very expensive but we can replace uh, them it seems so that we can replace this stuff expensive substance only with nicotinamide which is uh, easy available okay uh, so if, if anybody interested please uh, like the video and uh, comment it, it is a good motivation for me to produce another video with my uh, describing my experience and describing some new findings in this area and uh, okay and have a good day